Hola YouTube, my name is Ricardo Lino and I'm a wheel addict. I just bought the newest DVD from Mike Torres. Do you say DVD or VOD? Oh my god, this is not working today, huh? Hola YouTube, my name is Ricardo Lino and I'm a wheel addict. I just bought the newest VOD from Mike Torres. It's called Nights and Weekends. I think that's it. Nights and Weekends. Yes. By the name, it seems like it's something that was filmed after work, after school, and obviously on weekends when people are not. Basically, by the name, you would think it's done by non-professional skaters. Uh, there's not a lot of professional skaters out there nowadays, but still, after watching that, all those guys should be professionals. Basically, what I'm trying to say is like the level of skating is amazing. Uh, from Augusto Castillo, I think that's his name, which is the guy that has the first profile and it's one of the guys that helped Mike Torres with the video. That guy had a really, really good section. Augusto Castillo has one trick which it's hard to explain but basically he slides on fr on both front wheels on a bench on a wooden bench and he slides on both front wheels and then he still pops out of it which means that he's completely in control of it it's really hard to explain you really really need to see it because that's what it is and then the second guy is Eddie Chunk, I think that's how you say it, Eddie Chunk, with this Chinese music, I think he is an Asian for sure, I think he might be Chinese by the name, but I'm not really sure, but his first trick got me like, yes, I'm not gonna say it, it's just like a super precise 360, but it's hard to explain the spot, I'm not gonna explain the spot, and I'm not going section by section, there's a lot of really good tricks, there's one trick, from someone that I wasn't expecting, which is Garrett Slobey. I don't know if you remember Garrett from Life Plus videos, but he used to be amazing. And I'm really, really happy to see that guy still skating. Then there's this other guy. I, I had to leave this there because I didn't know all these guys' names. But there was a guy, let me see if I remember his name. I think it's Nick Fatato. Let me see. I'll go. It's this guy. The guy, there's a lot of amazing tricks, but it's this guy. This guy, Ted Labozeta, awesome. I love all these tricks. It's just, he has a clean style, he loves to do gaps. The first trick that he does is a proper stale over the back of a car. It's amazing. I'm not gonna talk all the tricks, man. I need to stop, because otherwise I'm just telling you everything and if you didn't then you don't want to buy it and you need to buy it I can also say that the last trick from Grant Hazelton it's amazing and he ate a lot of things he ate a lot of to land it but he did land it of course Mike Torres has a section and his section is really good there's a lot of tricks also with wizard frames which makes it super different from the rest of the the guys but at the same time it all fits the way it was filmed it's it's kind of like i would say that this video is kind of like a, a mix of skateboarding with all the rawness and the fisheye but then the cinematography in the in this video it's amazing you'll see some stuff that was filmed by austin pass i think it was like all the drone shots and stuff was filmed by austin pass i wish there were more tricks from austin pass so as i wish there was some tricks from Abdel Goldberg that is living in New York right now. Well, I think from Austin Powell there's a few tricks or there's a trick, but from Abdel there's no tricks. And then the last section is Justin Brasco. I just wish there was more stuff from Justin Brasco out there because you might have seen the, the thing that he did last year, <laughs> but this is on another level. Is I'm not gonna say any of his tricks, you just need to see it. So basically Mike Torres is not asking for any money in specific. You can pay how much you want for this VOD. For those of you who don't know, I've explained it a few times what a VOD is. VOD means video on demand. And basically it's a video that you can buy instead of being open on YouTube or Vimeo or Facebook or whatever. Basically there's a lot more 
work put into that. What you see here right now, what you see here, these type of videos that I do almost every day, I call them disposable. Basically, I try to bring content every single day so that you can have something to watch every single day. Yes, it's free and it's also a lot of work, but you can't compare it with that. That's like a hard piece. Basically, those guys work according to the name after work, weekends, they all got together to get that project going and it's well worth whatever you think you're gonna pay for it. I paid $10, but I think I should have paid more. So I might still go and put some more cash in my tourist account because it's really well worth it. And there's also some other VODs that came out over the last month the last one that i bought before this was avalancha and avalancha is from mark moreno i would say it's a completely different video but the skating is also super super creative and i really love the rawness of it it's it's a lot more like a skateboarding style video like a i wouldn't say old school skateboarding it's more like a a new school yeah like a new school skateboarding video there's a lot of fisheye shots it's it's also really nice filmed but the spots that they skate on Avalanche, it's just awesome. You just need to see it because they went to the, the Spanish islands, they went to Canarias, they went to to Mallorca and the spots that they found, Mark Moreno and Adri Sa Minero, oh my God. Minero is just, he's a machine, man. The tricks that he does in that video is just like boom, boom, trick after another. I think he's the one with the most clips in that video. Also, there's like some tricks from Leon Humphries, uh, Carol Lindbergh. There's tricks from a lot of really, really good skaters. I guess you really need to see it too. So I'm gonna leave the link in the description for both these VODs. And if you're willing to spend a little bit of money, well, you're supporting the skate industry. So that's a way for you to help this whole thing going and that's what I wanted to tell you today guys so I hope you guys enjoyed this one if you did enjoy this one don't forget to subscribe to the channel there's a little red button if the button is gray don't click on it but if it's red click on it and make it gray once it's gray there will be a bell on the side the bell is just something like this if you press on that bell there's two more little things that I don't know the name of those things that will show up if those two things are outside the bell that means that you're gonna get notifications every time I upload one of these videos like either on the phone or email or something like that. If you're subscribing, you're not gonna get any notification, but YouTube might suggest this video to you a little bit more often than normal. That's it. And really important, just like I always say, don't forget why we all started skating, because it's fun. Cheers guys, and see you soon.